to my channel it's maddie adore and today i'll be doing butterfly locks this is my first time i'm gonna try it out i'm not a professional or any of that so let's just see how this goes okay guys so the first thing i did was wash my hair and put it in twist i use rubber bands to make it more neat and then the hair i'm going to be using to do the actual lock is this water wave hair from amazon i think it's like seven packs but I'm going to leave everything I use in the description. Y'all go check that out. So let's get onto the real hairstyle. So I'm going to try to do one of them by myself. So I'm going to take the crochet hook and put it in the twist. And then I'm going to take my hair and loop it on the hook. So open the hook and then try to hook the hair. And then close it and pull it through. Okay, so I'm pulling it through and then I'm gonna take the crochet hook out and grab one side. And then I'm gonna make one side longer than the other. I make this one shorter than this one and then I'm going to take the longer piece and wrap it at the top like four times. This might take me a minute, but let's see how this come out. So I'm going to start going down. Y'all just look. I don't know if y'all can really see, but I wrapped it at the top. I'm struggling out here. This is a stress. I'm gonna put my finger through it and then try to wrap wrap it on top. Like, hold up. Let's see, on top of the loop, and then go to the bottom and see if it come out. Okay, so that's a little. Well, that's kind of a big loop, but. I'm still trying. So I'll just keep wrapping and try to do a loop again. Okay, so when you get to the bottom, you're supposed to hold, like, like go like this. I believe, like, take your finger, and then you're supposed to just wrap back up. And then when you go up, you can make more, like, make it more distressed. And just wrapping it back up. And then you can let your finger go on the bottom. Okay, so this is what it's looking like. This is my first one, so it's not the best, but this is what it's looking like. Okay, so I'm doing another one. I already started. I, I started the top already. Now I'm going to try to make a loop. Like this. And then the top. And then go to the bottom and let it go. And just keep wrapping down. The hardest part is the loops and then the bottom. The rest of it is pretty easy. I'm just wrapping. And I'm about to do another loop. Mm -hmm. I don't know if that's going to be too big. 
that's where wrap it on top and go to the bottom let it go and then go to the bottom You can make as many loops as you want in yours. And then once you have it to the length you want it, you're going to just go back up. But I'm going to go a little farther. Okay. And then now it's, to the, it's almost to this one. So I'm going to just... Flip it. I don't, I don't really know how to do the bottom that well yet, that good yet, but I'm just keep trying until I get it. How I like it. Okay, so I'm going up now. Just keep wrapping it up. And just keep going until there's no more hair left. Okay, ooh. Okay, so this is this one. Okay guys, so this process is taking a long time, but this is what it looks like so far. And yeah, I already I have my hair on this rack. Look at my dog. Look at Bentley. But I have my hair on this rack so it would be easier for me to just grab it. But I'm gonna show y'all some more of the hair. Yeah. Okay, so this is what it's looking like right now. It's, we've been doing this for like three and a half hours and we're still not done. But I'm thankful I got my mom here helping me because if it would just been me by myself, I would have been here all night. But for the front, I'm using three strands of hair because my hair is like more thinner in the front and in the back I use two. But I'm gonna have to finish, I'm about to finish this Okay, time. so we're on the last two braids now. We're almost done.
Okay, guys, so after four and a half hours, we're finally done. This is what it looks like. This is our first time when it came out cute. I recommend y'all do this style because it's just cute. And the hardest part was just wrapping it back up and making it look distressed. But besides that, it was pretty good. Okay, y'all, thank you guys for watching. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And stay tuned for my next video.